This is an Iron Man made completely out of Air Jordans. And these are Travis Scott Phantoms with diamonds on them. These are the only one of one Pokemon Pikachu sneakers. And these are off-white Air Jordan 1 customs bedazzled in crystal. They were at the newest sneaker store in LA and they had crazy luxury sneakers. I can't wait for you guys to watch the entire video. What is this right here? This is absolutely crazy. At the front of a sneaker store, you have a like Tron setup drawing you in. Legit Nation, today we are at LA's newest sneaker store, Cop and Flex. They just opened up a couple weeks ago and I became really cool with them and the owner and I wanna show you guys what they're all about because this store is crazy. But like I said, right at the entrance guys, they got this really cool setup with the Tron bike, the Tron man, it is so fire. And let's go ahead and step on in to Confident Flex, the newest store taking over Melrose already with the Bear Bricks and some crazy customs all on the bears. This is just insane guys, but there's so much more to see. They have this moon statue in the middle of the sneaker store. The art is just out of this world, guys. The art is going crazy today. What other sneaker stores do y'all know with this type of centerpiece in the middle? Shout out to my man, Leo. This is the owner right here. How long ago did you guys open up, bro? Uh, since Black Friday. This since year. Black Friday, that's crazy. And I saw on your Instagram something like, you were once working at a Champs? Yes. Dude, yeah. that is insane. Yo, chase your dreams, guys, literally, because my man went from working at Champs, right, to owning the craziest sneaker store on Melrose Avenue. Insane. Insane. Yo, we literally have an Iron Man over here made of sneaker, what? Guys, look at this piece. That is crazy. It is like somebody took the sneakers apart and they made an Iron Man out of it. Yo, this is the craziest content ever. I didn't even know that they had this in here till now. I didn't even, bro, Iron Man statue out of retro Jordans. This is probably the craziest artwork I've ever seen, literally ever made of sneakers. Got the DJ Booth down pack, and this right here is going to be their massive sneaker wall. All kinds of heat, let's get straight into it and see what they got on this wall right here. Just every single dope sneaker you can imagine that you wanna find when you're out on Melrose Avenue. It's so crazy, man. Here in LA, we have access to literally any sneaker imaginable. Which is just another reason why I'm doing the dailies, man, because it's like, I live here now, and all this is fingertips away. It's liter I literally live down the street from Merrill's Avenue, and I have not been giving you guys daily videos, so make sure you subscribe if you're not already, because I'm definitely stepping up the game. Dude, look at, look at this, dude. Look at this. Would you guys rock these? Let me know down below. These are crazy. But we got way crazier shoes to show you in this video, because this door, it goes deep, man. It goes deep. All the foam runners right along here. You got all the Jordan 1s going along down there. Some unions, some dunks at the very bottom. We also got the LeBron South Beaches, some collabs, the Kai's up there. The Khalids, I've never seen these in person. I've seen the other Khalids in person, but I haven't seen these DJ Khalids in person. These are kind of dope, I'm not gonna lie. I feel like these would be easier to wear with things uh, <laughs> than these. Dude, I got these shoes. And the crazy thing is, is that like, Nike sent me an extra pair of these on accident. So when they came out, I thought they were gonna be super crazy. And so I told Beth to get them in the raffle. So I got a pair, I won a pair successfully, Beth won a pair successfully, and then Nike, well, they sent me a pair on accident in a size 12. I don't know how that got messed up, but crazy story. I got three of these back at home in Texas in like a storage unit. So crazy, crazy story with those. I always like weird stuff that, that other people don't have. Um, but I don't have a pair of these yet. I do not have a pair of these Yeezy slides. Super, super crazy with the design on these. But yeah, the whole store is just super crazy. And look at this giant mirror in the shape that it is in. This store deserves way more attention. And I wanna just show you guys because, like I said, I met them a couple weeks ago and this is an insane store. So let's continue on with the tour. This right here is the ultimate wall of heat. Now this store has stuff that other stores they just don't got, man. A lot of stores in LA do not have the PEs, which that is crazy to see in stores, the PEs. I know I know, maybe like one other store that carries the PEs, but guys, if you don't know, Nike always makes sneakers for, or Jordan makes sneakers for like different colleges, and, and the only people that get them are, are the people that are on the team. So like, this is an Oklahoma sneaker, and I don't know when this came out, but only Oklahoma players got it, or dude, look at this, UCLA, 
Custom. UCLA is a college in LA, guys, if you guys don't know, but UCLA 6, these were not released to the public. They were only released to the people at UCLA, the athletes that are like a part of it, and they got a bunch of them. So we got UCLA, we got OU, we got, uh, this is North Carolina, and then what is this, Air Jordan 1? This one looks crazy with like the uh, Stingray, OU again. Oklahoma, come through to LA and get yourself a pair of kicks. University of uh, North Carolina threes, and I know that they, they did these, Jordan came out with these, but with the NC, you're not gonna find it on there. Again, with the, what? Those are Ohio. What do you mean they're Ohio? What is Ohio? Which ones are Ohio? This is this is OU, isn't it? Yeah, it says OU on it, doesn't it? Or is it Ohio? I don't man. OU or Ohio, if I was wrong, comment down below. It doesn't matter. I'm just showing you guys the heat. I am just the, the one that shows you guys. I'm not the one that, that I'm, not, I'm not a data expert, okay? Don't come to this channel for that. Come to the channel because you want to be entertained and subscribe if you're new. The one crazy thing about this store, check out this sneaker right here, the Off-White Air Jordan 1. Now, Beth, when we first came to this store, you were super impressed because nobody ever has her size. Nobody in LA ever has their size, and they got a bunch of size fours though. No, no lie. Like, if you guys are ladies and you're looking for sneakers, look at this. This is such like a tiny. So Beth is like the Latina. She wears, you know, miniature sizing on there. And bro, for them having these in here, absolutely crazy, dude, insane. And and so, anyways, they got a lot of size fours. What else do they got in a size four in here? They got, Vapor dude, Maxes. Vapor Max is right here in a size four, which I don't think we've seen anywhere else. It's rare to come upon very, very little sizes. These two, these two, the, um, yeah, this is like one of my favorite sneakers of all time. Super, super comfortable, dude. Super comfortable as well. Which ones? Travis. The Travis the sixes. Four. A lot of size fours. A lot of size fours out here. But yeah, so this is just the wall that like, if you want to see heat, it's going to be on this wall, whether it be a Union or an Off-White or a Supreme collab, they're going to have it on this wall back here. Um, and, and this is really where, you know, all the heaters lie on this back wall. Then for my young people that are in school, I think, I think these are going to be the smaller sizes over here. Um, I believe that's what this wall is dedicated for. But uh, yeah, so they got, you know, more shoes over here if you guys want more shoes. Tons of clothing, man. Tons and tons of clothing. They got the Denim Tears, which is like a brand that is like taking over LA right now. Everybody's rocking this gallery department, which is something that's been hot. I told you guys. Um, but yeah, man, I've been really educating myself on the clothing here in LA because it's a lot different than Texas. People are way more into clothing out here. The Spider, which is a crazy brand that is taking over, Young Thug's brand. And yeah, this brand is definitely taking over. I actually got myself a hoodie recently, but they got a lot of dope pieces in here. And of course, Off-White, Bathing Ape, and a bunch of other brands on the clothing side of things. Uh, also Fear of God too. This thing is actually really cool. It's like a cement block of a Jordan. I don't really know what you're supposed to use this for, but it's like a literally molded Air Jordan. Pretty heavy. I don't want to drop it, and then I'm going to have to pay for it. <laughs> we got a bunch of crazy accessories in the case. The Murakami, the Murakami skateboard, all the accessories right here. Anti-social club. The chicken nugget when Travis Scott, or is that Travis Scott? I don't know. It says anti-social club. It looks like a chicken nugget. Some chrome over here. We got different like uh, versions of the ceramic Air Jordan 1s. Dude, this is crazy. The artwork in this shop is, is really crazy compared to like, you don't really see too many different art pieces on Melrose. Typically it's just like sneakers and you know, clothing, but this store has a lot of different artwork. Like, look at this, man. This is just pure art. That's insane. The print on there is going crazy. Yo, my man Leo, recently you guys did a collab and y'all guys came out with your own shoe, which this is probably one of the craziest sneakers I've ever had. I still need to pick one up myself, uh, but dude, there's glitter and water and the art goes crazy on these. Talk to us a little bit about these. So these ones are the H52, it's just like a brand that we're working with. And then uh, we saw their design is very similar to some of the higher end stuff. Yeah, and yeah. It's like, uh, they come with different colors. These ones, honestly, by far is one of the best sellers we have. And then also like the value wise, it for sure. Toy oh really? It comes with the toy. Mm -hmm. That's crazy, man. Like, I mean, typically you see different people coming out with shoes, and it looks very similar to other stuff. But, dude, this is something that is like super unique, and and yeah, it, it looks like designer. It looks like designer kicks, and it's crazy that you guys are like coming out with your own shoes. Like that's nuts for a sneaker store already, because you guys just opened and you're already coming out with shoes. Craziness, dude. Craziness. I love the way the water is in there. That's super unique. Sparkle, sparkle. Dude, that's fire. I think I think this one's probably my favorite. 
because it just like it's out there you know what i mean and it has the the glistening on there um but for sure dude i could definitely see you like wearing these to the club or something crazy so dope dude and then on the other side of the register just customs on customs on customs for sale honestly some of the craziest sneakers i've ever seen i feel like sometimes like to see something like this you literally have to like go and google and like see see some of these like this is crazy man leo how much does something like this one go for like the bedazzled one uh, they're actually going on for $4.99. $4.99, okay, $500 for these, which isn't too bad, man, because you know nobody's gonna have these. Is that an actual Travis right here? No. This one's like basically based on the custom customer wants so if they were to want like a specific style yeah uh, the company works with them from the style to color and then to specification and that person they just want a bedazzle phantom so that's crazy but is it did they use it the travi as a base the the not is it an actual travis scott but like did they use an actual like phantom no no oh wow so that's literally like yeah, all custom yeah that's how they can uh, drive down the price oh nice there. so how much is this one 499 for something that looks like a phantom Dude, it looks exactly like a phantom. Yeah. That's so sick. Dude, this is fire. Oh my gosh. These shoes are absolutely crazy. Each one was inspired by different Jordans and they're just pure works of art, man. It is insane. Y'all have never seen anything like this before, dude. Pokemon custom, you got the Pikachu on the front. And dude, I can only imagine, it's gotta take them forever to like make these customs because they go in deep. The Pikachu face on the back, that is so sick. And then even, we got the off-white. Dude, $4.99 for this? Wow, that is insane, dude. That's the beauty of custom. I would totally, I love, I love just having stuff that nobody else has, you know what I mean? And like, this stuff is truly, truly like, dude, you know, you go to like an event or something wearing these, everybody's gonna be freaking out about these. That's crazy, and you got even, the UNC uh, inspired one, which is so dope. Dude, these things are fire. I love it. I love it, man. I don't know, man. I might have to come back for uh, for the Phantom because this one's really... So you can you can basically tell them whatever you want and they'll make it or for $4.99? Yep. That's wild. And how long does it take to get one of these made? So basically the time to make them is around two weeks. Two weeks. Dude, that's not bad at all. Two weeks is not bad at all. And they do other stuff too, which is crazy. Look at that. Two two tongues on there. Insane. Zipper on there. Okay. Okay. What is this? Like Python skin? $4.99 for these two. Yes. Nuts. Nuts, dude. That is so sick. Dude, look at this, man. Yeah, I'm definitely, I'm definitely gonna have to get some for sure. I'm definitely gonna have to get some, guys. This is this is crazy. All right, big shout out to my man Leo having us over here at Cop and Flex. Again, it's on Melrose Avenue. It's one of the newer stores. You got anything you want to finish off? Um, yeah, come through. Come through and uh, tell them legit Tim sent you because this store is dope and we'll definitely film more challenges and different things here. So shout out to Cop and Flex. Welcome to LA.